In northwest China, a desert land ravaged by wind and sand where life cannot survive, a miracle of green renaissance is quietly taking place. Here, more than 8,000 Chinese workers have transformed a barren land into the world's largest photovoltaic power generation park. In this park, 540 kilometers of solar photovoltaic panels are arranged in an orderly manner, covering an area equivalent to 10,000 football fields. Viewed from a high altitude, more than 7 million solar panels form a spectacular blue sea and become a beautiful landscape in this desert. Although developing photovoltaics in deserts is a good idea, the challenges it faces cannot be ignored. Since photovoltaic panels are spread over vast areas of land, their power generation efficiency decreases once dust accumulates or is overrun by weeds. Over the past decade, some countries have spent millions of dollars each year maintaining photovoltaic panels. But in contrast, Chinese staff used a magical method. They chose to raise 300,000 sheep in a photovoltaic base. These sheep not only help clear boards and weeds, but also maintain power generation efficiency. In today's video, we will explore China, the world's largest photovoltaic base, and see how they maintain it with 300,000 sheep. If you like our video content, please click to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you can receive all our latest video content. Now let's get into today's topic. Talatan Photovoltaic Power Station is located in a desert land in Qinghai Province, China. A long time ago, the land here was almost completely occupied by desert, with a desertification rate as high as 98.5%. There was no one living for dozens of kilometers, forming a desolate natural picture. However, it is in this forgotten land that Chinese engineers built a project that attracted world attention. In 2012, the Chinese government proposed an ambitious plan to build a 600-square-kilometer photovoltaic power generation base in this desert. Considering the huge scale of the project, Chinese engineers decided to implement it gradually in seven phases. The first phase of the project cost 300 million US dollars to build a photovoltaic power station covering 78 square kilometers, an area equivalent to 10,000 football fields. Since December 2019, the first phase of this power station has started generating electricity, providing stable power supply to at least 3 million households every year. In fact, the reason why Chinese engineers chose this site as the site is that it is sparsely populated and there is no need to worry about interference from human activities. At the same time, it is located at an altitude of 2,920 meters above sea level, with an average of more than 3,000 hours of sunshine per year. These conditions jointly create an ideal natural power plant. Although Terra Beach provides ideal conditions for power generation, the land is also challenging. Strong sandstorms and frequent sandstorms can cover hundreds of photovoltaic panels, seriously affecting the efficiency of photovoltaic power generation. Workers need to regularly clean up accumulated dust to ensure efficient operation of the power station. During the process, the staff unexpectedly discovered that the water used to clean the photovoltaic panels actually nourished the arid land, thus nurturing these grasses. Over time, the entire desert formed a vibrant oasis. In order to further protect the photovoltaic bridge abutment, the staff chose to sow more grass seeds under the photovoltaic panels so as to create a green energy station that can both produce electricity and improve the ecology. In just a few months, a mutually beneficial and symbiotic relationship was established between the photovoltaic panels and the grass. Because the photovoltaic panels provide necessary shade for the grass seedlings, protecting them from direct sunlight and slowing down the evaporation of water in the soil, these grasslands not only beautify the environment, but also help stabilize the soil and reduce sandstorms. But as grass grows, new crises arise. When the height of grass exceeds the height of photovoltaic panels, these lush vegetation begin to block sunlight and prevent the absorption of light energy. 
What's even scarier is that if these rapidly growing grasslands are not properly managed, the dead grass can become a fire hazard during the dry season. Serious fire accident can completely destroy more than 7 million photovoltaic panels. Faced with the problem of too much grass in power stations, Chinese engineers are very troubled. Because these grasses cannot be dug out directly, otherwise the sandstorm problem will come back again. But it seems like a waste of time to mow the grass manually. After all, workers need to focus their time on collecting data and maintaining photovoltaic equipment. Just when everything seemed to be at an impasse, an engineer came up with a unique and effective solution, raising sheep and weeding. His proposal was to introduce a flock of sheep and use the flock to consume excess turf. In order to ensure the safety and efficiency of the photovoltaic base, the staff initially only introduced 80 sheep for experimental grazing. To make it easier for these sheep to get food, they even adjusted the installation height of the solar panels from 50 centimeters to 120 centimeters. This adjustment allows the sheep to pass freely under the solar panels without causing damage to the photovoltaic panels. The trial lasted for more than two months, and the results surprised everyone. Because the flocks not only effectively remove weeds from the ground, they also ensure that the solar panels stay clean, thereby increasing energy efficiency. At the same time, the sheep eat the vegetation that grows under the power station and their excrement in turn provides natural fertilizer for the soil, promoting a better ecological balance. Due to the remarkable results of the experiment, the project team was encouraged to expand the size of the sheep herd. At the same time, they also invited surrounding herders to participate, gradually transforming the photovoltaic park into an area with both energy production and efficient pasture functions. As of 2023, the photovoltaic park already has 270 sheep pens, with more than 300,000 sheep living here. These sheep enjoy cooling under the solar panels, while also maintaining the normal power generation of the photovoltaic base. Locally, these sheep are affectionately called photovoltaic sheep herders. What is more repetitive is that an adult sheep can eliminate about 5 pounds of weeds every day. They use almost all their free time to forage. This natural and efficient way greatly reduces the burden of manual cleaning. In this mode, solar power station staff only need to provide necessary drinking water facilities for the sheep. Experience shows that about 1,000 sheep can clean more than 1,000 acres of solar energy sites in half a month. This not only solves the cleaning problem of the power station, but also provides a sustainable farming method for the local area, forming a win-win model that takes into account both environmental and economic benefits. Today, this model of combining solar power generation with farming has been adopted by many countries. The sheep are docile by nature and will not damage cables or other equipment, instead focusing on their favorite food grass. This innovative method not only reflects the integration between modern technology and traditional breeding, but also echoes the concept of ecological agriculture advocated by people, providing new ideas for sustainable development. So, do you think this approach is good?